Hi everybody, welcome back to Charlie and me, our camping vlog. It's another one of these COVID-19 videos. Um, this is the bank holiday weekend, the June bank holiday weekend in Ireland. It's actually the bank holiday Monday and it should be at Van Tastival. It has been moved to September, but to be honest, the way things are going in the country, we can't see this happening in September either, but fingers crossed. We're out in the yard and the reason we're here is if you remember, um, there's a mechanic in this yard called Anthony and he fitted the A-frame to the Fiat. Oh, we haven't even got to use it. I think we've used it once on the Paddy's weekend and then we hit lockdown. Well, the same chap is now going to fit a new skylight. I had the camper van home a couple of weeks back and I popped open all the skylights and the bathroom one has only ever been popped up one way. And when I popped up the front legs, they snapped. So I got onto Pat Horan's. Pat uh, Horan Motors in English have a shop online. 24 hours later, a new skylight arrived with the proper glue to put it down and Anthony said he'll do it for me. I asked him could we make a video of it and that's what we're doing today. Bank holiday Monday morning, 10 minutes to nine, absolutely beautiful day and what are we doing? We're fitting a skylight. I'm going to stick the drone up so you can have a look at just the skylight that's there now. I'm going to put the GoPro up on the roof and that'll watch Anthony doing all the outside stuff and I'll take you inside now and just show you inside the shower where the skylight is broken. So this is where it, it had snapped on me. You can see they broke. So now we have it literally all off, uh, ready to attack from the roof. So this is inside where I broke it and Anthony's gonna take out all the inside screws. They sh it should be pretty straightforward because uh, I don't think it's ever been replaced before. And then we'll take a look outside, all the cleaning that'll have to be done. This is the new skylight I got from Pat Horan's. Um, I think I rang him on a Monday and I had it Wednesday morning. As I say, with the proper glue, uh, it's slightly different. The only difference actually is that, that grill, the opening part of the grill, that's actually the only difference. The rest of it is pretty much similar, but it's the right size and that's all that matters. And we're gonna put that in now. Anthony was just saying that if this is the original skylight, the glue they use is great. It's still flexible, so it hasn't gone hard which means that it wouldn't be cracking as you're driving and bouncing around. Um, even if it's not the original skylight, it's possibly in a few years. I mean, we have the camper almost two years. So if it's even in four years, the gunk is still pretty flexible, where some gunks you use will dry up, go hard. And when they go hard, then obviously with the flexing, it means that they could uh, just end up going brittle and then cause leaks. And I think that's why uh, Olivia and Pat Horan sent us the proper glue to use. It's just the proper glue. So we'll be putting that on now as soon as we clean off what's up on the roof. So we've got the roof piece fitted and Anthony's in the shower now. He had to close the door because there's um, 
the cover when we opened down the cover he couldn't open it down with the shower with the shower door open so he's just going to uh, put in a couple of screws and it's the screws that pull it down tight and create that seal around the roof so uh, I still can't get over how soft the original rubber glue the glue was around the skylight and it's still very very soft so this is the way I wanted that grill to hang down so Anthony has to close the shower door but when he puts his tightens down on the screws that's going to uh, do everything else pull it into place I've heard the experts say on videos and I've been told that if you as you tighten down from the inside if there's an even layer of caulk squeezing out that means you've done a right job well it means that you've put enough on and as you can see we've uh, an even layer now I hit that with my finger there a second ago but sure but it's nicely done and then the job inside is pretty clean this one as I say has a, a door that comes down I, I like that idea uh, I will have to close the shower door to allow it to come down here but that's fine that's absolutely fine we started this job bang on nine o'clock I had set up the cameras and Anthony start unscrewing inside the bathroom at nine o'clock it is 27 minutes past nine he's just tightening up he just has to literally take his tools away so half an hour done properly I've got to be honest I think if I was doing this on my own I'd still be peeling the gunk off the roof and would I have cleaned it properly possibly would I have put enough caulk on and glue on possibly but at least this way I know it's been done right and all in half an hour on a bank holiday Monday sure where else would I be going and uh, as you saw from the roof the caulk all came out evenly which means that as he was tightening down that's a good sign that you've got enough gunk the whole way around now you can gunk the outside again if you want to you can go and clean it all with your finger uh, Anthony reckons there's no point in doing that he's just going to get up now check the roof and jobs are good on so it's another one of our COVID-19 videos hopefully by the time you get to watch this as I say it's the bank holiday weekend while we're doing it hopefully by the time you get to watch it everything is back to some kind of normality and we're all out camping again and Charlie and me are out doing a couple of more campsite reviews thank you for your support if you haven't already done so could you subscribe to the channel click on the bell and uh, don't forget the podcasts with myself and Chris as well um, anchor dot fm forward slash the camping crew or whatever you listen to your podcasts if you want some of our charlie and me stickers please do email your details to charlie at aaronbirchill.com we get stickers to free you get a window sticker you get a bumper sticker and you get one of the stickers from the camping crew podcast as well thank you for watching stay safe if we're still in oh, stay safe regardless of what times we're in and we'll talk to you again hopefully from a campsite very very soon here on charlie and me our camping vlog Take care. Oh, hashtag fantastical.